All right, what's up, guys? We are about to just do some main story missions. First, I need a haircut. I got a haircut in real life, so we gotta get a cut in the game, obviously. Like, what the fuck? I just need to see where this place is. I forgot. All right, I'm pretty close. I'm gonna set a waypoint. Here we go. What up, everybody? I'm back. And better than ever. Just need to get a fresh cut real quick. Come on in. Come Thanks. on in. Don't be shy. Oh, I'm not. How's it going? I'm trying to talk to you, but it's not working. There we what go. What is it you might be interested in? Well, I got a haircut. Um, I'm trying to find a cut that really looks like my new cut. That is not my haircut. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, right here. There we go. Is that my haircut? All right, this is it. All right, let's do these main missions. Herbology class. Or should we do Professor Hecate? Let's let's do this. Let's go learn the new spell. Then we'll do herbology. We're gonna learn Expelliarmus. Expelliarmus. <laughs> Expelliarmus. <laughs> All right, whatever. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right, we'll travel right here, right next to it. All right. Wait, 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 wait. I know how to I know how to open these chests now. Hold on. I've always said that travel Those chests right there. So what you got to do is you got to be invisible. Um yeah, you got to be invisible. And you got to sneak up to it. Gotcha! 500 coins. Aw, poor guy. It's okay. Alright, let's go find, um, Hecate. Excuse me? Trying to be a little more polite to the students today. You can advance time by accessing the map and pressing R. That's dope. All right, what up? I'm ready. Professor, I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Hmm. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. Although, we got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigella's flag for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. Uh, I, I hadn't realized uh? that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. What do you mean? How awful or how fascinating? Time itself. I never would have imagined such a thing. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Ah! As you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. What? Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. Now... I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. I guess. Thank you for speaking with me, you Professor. You made me more Keep curious. Up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. Okay. Wait. I thought you were going to teach me, uh, Expelliarmus. Oh, I have to attend the class during the day? Are you fucking... Are you fucking kidding me? All right. Advance time from day to night or night to day. Yes. Here we are. What's up, everybody? I was waiting here all night. She's 
not talking. Is she supposed to be talking? What a fun class. I don't know what just happened. Professor. I hope you were able to take care of everything I had asked you to do. I did. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Yeah, my hair looked pink as well fuck. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Hmm. Facts. Spell casting requires a focused mind and Ooh. a steady mind. Ooh. Ooh. Kill them. Ooh. Expelliarmus. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. What did you just call me? Hell no, she didn't call me dummy. All right, so I'm going to try and keep the color codings the same, I think. So, this is Expelliarmus. I'm going to assign it to A. I'm going to put this one back on X. It just makes sense to keep the color codings the same. That way, when I'm in battle, I don't forget. You know what I'm saying? Expelliarmus. You seem to have the right end of the stick. That's right! Come at me, bro. Alright, well that's dope. Let's go now. What we got we got more to do. So oh wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna go to quests. Herbology class. Locate on the map. I'm glad they have that option. It's all the way the fuck over here, man. So I'm gonna travel to this flu flame. All right. You look like Tom Holland. Spider-Man? <laughs> Sorry. Alright, let's go. Never know what to say when I write to mother. Hello, mother. Hello, mother. I wish I had a Oh, what's this guy doing? What the Expelliarmus. When will I be able to unlock these? God damn it. All right. Herbology. I'd what up, guys? If you stopped that. Stopped what? Look, I'm trying to be nice today. Don't my push my button. Professor Weasley's class when he was in school. He'd idly wave his wand while daydreaming. I don't think I've been over here. Ooh. Revelio. Ooh, nice. Greenhouse tree. It's beautiful. You can't im Found a flu flame. I just want to see what's down here real quick. Oh, I thought I saw something glowing. I am tripping. Ooh, what is this? Some Dittany leaves. Mmm, my fave. We're going to see who can stay up the latest. Sleeping drafts should ensure my victory. Some flux weed. Damn. Oh fuck! Getting all the herbs over here. What's down here? This is spooky. Oh, look, a chest. Okay, okay, okay. So what I'm gonna do, like I said, is keep the color codings the same. So I'm gonna assign it to Y. Just gonna sneak up on ya. 500. 
Damn, we're fucking rich, honestly. All right, let's go. Time for class. What up? What are you up to now? Damn it, I wish I could unlock those. Begin! God damn, so many butterflies. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora, dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, Professor uh, Garlic? Uh, a little treat for your auntie. <laughs> the fuck? Oh, hello. Hello. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We Are you, is she dissing my pink hair? How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. Ah, yes. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing ball. Huh? Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Accio. Oh, great. Oh, Let's great. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. <laughs> oh, no, I don't want to hear this shit. Oh, fuck. Now, everyone, grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. Oh, no. <laughs> What the fuck? Repot? Oh god! Me when I get out of bed. <laughs> Me waking up early. <laughs> the soil should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Great. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. Oh, was it now? All right then, off you go. Well, thanks. Splendid work, everyone. Thanks for giving me now, the most. For our next task will be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I need to have a brief word with our new student. All right. The best time to plant a seed is last season. The second best time is now. All right. So you want to talk to me after class, huh? Hmm. I wonder if hippogriffs like knot grass. I don't know. Did you know that you can use the mandrake to defend yourself? Why, the very idea. Pretty cool. All right, what's up? Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Thanks. Uh, I'll just say I enjoyed it, even though I didn't. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. Having a good day. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. <laughs> now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the magic neep. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. It wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how okay. to balance my star thistle arrangement. I Lithia guess. Or roses. I guess I'm going to plant some seeds. Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. All right, so I have a potting table. Oh, wait, what do I... Select the seeds to begin planting. Diddy seeds. Wait. Dittany seeds. Fuck. 
Dittany, ready in nine minutes. Okay, so I can grow shit that I need for what? For like potions and shit? Right. Well done! Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. Ooh! I'll let Professor oh, I can make Sharp tell you about that. To heal myself. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora. The Chinese chomping cabbage. Uh, You'll find that some plants chomping? are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Mr. Come Pruitt. and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. Charlie! Mind your fingers. Alright, where's Pruitt? What up, Pruitt? Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. What up, I'll bro? be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But, your lead. Alright. You're a little too, uh... I don't know, there's something about you, bro. I got my eye on you, buddy. Nice work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Oh, thank Excuse you. Excuse me. Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Ha! <laughs> oh. I did. Well, thank you. Appreciate I it. I really put Sebastian in his place myself. I mean, I would have if Hecate hadn't stopped me. Sure. Didn't she stop that dragon skull from crushing you? <sighs> Typical Slytherin trick, dropping a dragon skull on someone during a fight. We Gryffindors fight with honor. Uh, no offense. Sorry. Yeah, what the fuck, bro? I'm a Slytherin, bro. I'll fucking slither into your fucking... You know what? I'm not even gonna say it. <laughs> but I will say it! If you talk shit again, boy. Alright, where am I going? Holy shit, I'm lost. Alright, down here. Here we are. Home of the Chinese chomping cabin. Alright. Grab a few of those cabbages. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it, and they'll do the rest. Toss the cabbages. Wait, what? Attack the target dummy. How do I do that? Whoa! I've never done this before. Wait, what? Look at that! Oh! I'll chomp on anything they can get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Okay, that was Vicious kinda little cool. bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Hey, watch your like mouth. Stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. What? The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. Uh, not saying your you mama's booba tube. <laughs> well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could come in handy. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out Facts. there. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. All right, well. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. There you go. <laughs> I tried to throw it at him. All right, well, that's pretty dope, honestly. What is this? Eterus Potion, a potion that enhances the drinker's defense. Ooh, by covering me with rocky skin. Dude, these are dope. These are kind of like... It's almost like abilities, but it's like help. All right, all right, all right. 
Ashwind eggs. Pretty dope. Where the fuck? Wait, can I collect more shit? Hold on, hold on, hold on. While I'm here, I might as well collect all of this. Alright. Locked door, of course. Of course! Oh. I thought that was a page. Beautiful. Just beautiful. What is this? Nice. Alright, let's go talk to Mrs. Garlic. And with that helpful reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves, I shall end our lesson here. Terribly sorry, Mr. Clopton. Alright, what's up? I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. As am I. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Mm. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. Hey. You better calm down, ma'am. I'll be back on my own accord. Alright, well, that was fun. New quest available! Everybody move! I do wonder about Professor Fig. He's hardly ever in his classroom. Most strange. How about you mind your business, huh? Alright, sorry, sorry, sorry. <sighs> Alright, let's check out our new quests. Let's see what's up. Potions class. Nice. Maybe I will use my new herbs. I might as well just fast travel over here. Hopefully I traveled to the wrong, I mean to the right one. <laughs> All right. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Great. You say that every fucking day. I bet he knows more than he's letting on about the Goblin Rebellion. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Nice. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular <laughs> potion might come in handy. Yes, Professor Sharp. To heal. The Wigan Well Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, I knew but it. not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Oh, damn, Before that hit him deep. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld Potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Facts. Please begin. All right, I'm ready. Uh. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Ugh. Ugh. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze Bing. could be disastrous. Stir this shit up. 
Damn, we cooking. Oh yeah, we're cooking up now. Hell yeah. Just let me cook. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. <laughs> I did it. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. Thanks. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yeah, yes, sir. I Good. have it. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. Nice. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Okay. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. Oh, it's skill, buddy. It is skill. But Professor Sharp said that Wigan. My parents considered keeping me home hey, from school this year after the rumors of a goblin rebellion. Don't interrupt. I was fucking talking. Great. Now I can't even hear what the fuck she wanted to say. My Wigan World potion's utter rubbish. Wish I could just replace it with one from Jay Pippins. Well, guess what? You can't. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go a into Weasley. his office? You heard correctly, Weasley. He did say that. He what? wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! What? You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. Oh, no. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Pleasure uh -huh. to meet you. Wait, are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps hmm. too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Suck. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adjurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. Mm -hmm. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fupa feather. Fupa. As you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission, perhaps you could grab it for me. <sighs> you know what? Fine, Gareth, all right? Maybe this'll benefit me. I'll get you the Fupa feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Whoopa. Whoopa feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. All right. You better not fuck me over. All right. Uh, you can read this if you want. I don't want to read it out loud. All right, cool. All right, where's the foopy feather? Right here. Oh, he's gonna notice that shit's missing, bro. Look how cute that shit is. Man, he just got me in trouble, I bet. Should not be that color, Mr. Dowell. Here's the foopy feather you wanted. Here's the foopy. Brilliant, thank you. This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Adjurus potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. All right. Proficiency Endurous. Things that cannot be rushed. Have patience and be Okay, calm. so I need... Wait. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Brewing time, 27 seconds. Nice. Not long at all. So I can let it. And now we add the mallow sweet, and that's odd. What's happening? Well, this is pretty Wait, dope. It's not supposed to. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Gareth! Wait. What yeah, Gareth. Well done, Gareth. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor, again. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. No, no, it couldn't have been me. Ah, oh, fuck, I fucked up. All right, Hork 
pork lump juice. Damn, I wish I could brew another Wigan Weld. Ah, oh, fuck. Am I in trouble? Damn it, Weasley. You fucked me over. Wasn't expecting that literally to blow up in my face. It was rather brilliant, though. Oh, great. Well, now look. Clean up. You got me you in trouble, too. Your potion if you haven't already. Yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever. I'll deal with this shit myself. I brewed an Adurus potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. Fuck, he knew it was me. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> I'll just tell the truth, fuck it. I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. Yeah, 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 yeah. I yeah, shall yeah. assume that you've learned a lesson. I did. As Weasley's for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In yeah. addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Okay. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Okay. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Class dismissed. We did it. Oh, so. My robes are going to reek from Gareth's inspiration for the rest of the term. Right, everybody move. I want to get out of class. We're free! Okay, well. Greetings, young Slytherin. What the? Scrope knows about the old book you found for Professor Feek. Scrope can help you. And you can help Scrope. <gasps> get to the courtyard past the pendulum. If you don't know it, you'll see it easy enough. And don't tell anyone what you're up to. Especially Professor Black. Okay. Scrope, is that the one that I saw disappear earlier? Damn it, Scrope. You're going to get me in trouble. Uh, all right, shorter episode today, but the next one will be out probably tomorrow. But I will see you guys then in the next one. And we'll go meet up with Scrope. I'll see you then. Peace out. Awesome.